What's going on you guys? Ray Ferrazzi here and I just wanted to do a little update since I posted the video about a month ago about which competition I'm going to be prepping for. So good news, bad news. Bad news is that I won't be able to compete in that competition. I believe it was the first or second weekend of August. So what I didn't realize is that there is a limited number of shows that as a pro you can compete in. This is going to be my first pro men's physique bodybuilding competition, so I'd never done that before, and I just assumed I could basically pick a competition like I always had previously as an amateur, and then just go to that show and compete as a pro. So it wasn't until I was trying to register and sign up for the competition that I realized, oh, I can't, I can't compete on this date. So that's when I looked at the list of available dates for the pro competitors, and I went over, you know, I was trying to, I, at first I was trying to pick a date that was really close to it so that I could make it work. But in the end, you know, considering things like convenience, how far or close the competition is, and factoring costs of travel and stuff like that, as well as just all the other things going on in my life with timing and all of that, um, I've settled on a new competition date. So that's the good news. The good news is I've secured a competition date where I can compete as a pro and it's actually really cool because previously unbeknownst to me for the first time ever INBA PNBA that's the federation that I'm competing for is going to hold their competition in Muscle Beach that's in Venice California as most of you know Muscle Beach is very very famous for bodybuilding bodybuilding history uh, there's still plenty of competitions that go on there, and that's where the famous Gold's Gym, the Mecca, is located. So they're going to be having their first ever tested event at Muscle Beach. Iron Man Magazine will be there covering it as well. Iron Man Magazine is a big bodybuilding magazine, and they have recently switched over to covering and focusing their energy on natural athletes, which, which I think is really cool. And I think that's something that the industry needs to move towards more and more in order to maintain respect and credibility in the industry as a sport. And especially if we want to be recognized as, as an Olympic level um, sport. So that's why INBA PNBA has Olympic level drug testing. We're going to be doing that at Venice Beach, Muscle Beach, covered by Ironman Magazine. I think that's really awesome. I think the competition, therefore, is going to be really, really big because it's a first and it's really cool and it's great exposure. So honestly, I'm not, not, it's not even on my radar to win. I just, I, I would, I would be amazed if I placed, if I was like top five, I would be really, really proud of myself. There's a lot of veteran pro athletes that just look absolutely incredible and who knows what international competitors will show up as well and they're just adding more talent to the mix so I think that's really cool I think it's a really great event to be a part of uh, it's historic in a lot of ways so that's the event I'm gonna prep for I'm gonna be starting that with my coach starting July so just after I get back from World Pride in New York and I will most certainly keep you updated on my prep now that we're starting up in July, stick around. This is going to be a really cool prep and a really cool show at the very end. All right, guys. Peace.